Hi there YouTube, it's Kevin here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. To my surprise, I am also delivering this video to you guys right now. And you know, if you follow my Instagram stories, you kind of understand why I am also surprised. It's because I did mention that I was experiencing a lot of technical difficulties with my laptop. It wasn't working for a prolonged period of time, but now it just randomly started working. So if it's working, so am I. <laughs> and let's bring you guys that December 2018 favorites video. So. Um, like the November favorites video, I'm actually going to just go through this entire favorites video from head to toe without any sort of like section splitting. So let's jump straight into it. So as for my first kind of December favorite, I'd like to mention these Seinhauser headphones that I got from Black Friday. These are really high quality headphones and I really mention them as a favorite because when I travel or when I go on an airplane or when I'm on a train, these are the go-to things that I put on my ears just because it blocks out all the sound and it allows me to rest, it allows me to sleep, it allows me to like enjoy like breathing. You know, like, even like sitting next to a baby, I can put these on and just completely drown out the crying, which is really interesting, actually. But thanks to my roommate who recommended me these headphones, I have been able to enjoy my traveling life without, you know, suffering as much as, you know, traveling, I suppose. <laughs> Anyways, that's first up on the list for the next December favorite. I'd like to mention the Fear of God Essentials collaboration with Converse and these all-star 70s are a really really nice classic go-to shoe it's a very simple silhouette and I mean for me they're gonna be a pair of beaters but stylish beaters at that I suppose you know it's just one of those really durable really everlasting styles that you know you can't ever go wrong with and it's super comfortable too like just like the Comme des Garcons, like, you know, like, Hidden Heart collab, they have, like, this, like, extra squishy, like, I don't know if it's, like, a sole or something, but it just feels really good, you know, like, just, just understand that. It's, it, it's a very comfortable shoe. So, for the silhouette and for the style, it's just a timeless classic. So, definitely a December favorite, and check it out if you need something like this in your wardrobe, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so, for the next thing on my list, I wanted to mention this Blue de Chanel travel size cologne. So if you didn't know, I like low-key really like smelling good and <laughs> picking up this cologne was on my list for like a long, long time now. Probably like two years I've liked the scent a lot. But I finally got it in travel size because I ran out of one of my travel size scents and I was just like, you know what? Might as well do it. So I do have this Blue de Chanel travel size cologne. It's the EDT, which is you, I'm gonna butcher this by the way, you de toilet te, something like that. Anyways, so this travel size scent is really, really strong and I love strong scents because you just have to apply a small amount of them and they'll last for a while. It's especially helpful if you're traveling, you know, like on 14 hour flights and you just want to smell like relatively good throughout the entire flight despite becoming stanky boy. Of course, I did pick up the scent during finals week, so it was also a nice relief from all the other engineers in my proximity that became really stanky boys. So, you know, nice to drown out some of the BO in my environments. This is a must have. <laughs> of course, Blue de Chanel is just a really timeless classic scent, so Go ahead and check it out at your local, I guess, Sephora or Macy's or something like that if you have one. Alright, for the next one on my list here, I have my Nintendo Switch Smash Bros. Limited Edition Pro Controller. Um, I guess it doesn't have to be the Smash Bros. Pro Controller, but just Nintendo Switch Pro Controllers in general are really, really comfortable. Especially if you plan on gaming on the Switch for a really, really long time. I have picked this up and I have played games on this, like, non-stop. Like, I literally can't hold any other controller when I play on my Switch now. It's such a great controller for Smash, and it's great for Mario Kart and everything else as well. Um, of course, the reason why I say this is because for the Nintendo Switch, the way that the Joy-Cons are actually designed, it's very, like, pressuring on my thumb to, like, you know, like, wiggle down in certain areas. But with the Pro Controller, it's super natural because it's just, like, how my thumb extends. So I, I'm sure like 
I'm not the only one who has this problem, but if I am, you know, like, you don't need to check out the Pro Controller, but if you have the problem as well, check it out, you know, it's a great controller. Of course, next up on my list, I wanted to mention my Supreme Utility Bag, and so this is something I copped from, you know, the first Supreme drop of Fall Winter 2018, and it was the one that I really, really wanted for myself, because this thing is just such a nice bag. It fits everything that I need for toiletries, like literally everything. I literally take this bag out of my bag for TSA to check it, and then you know, put it back in. It's so convenient. You don't have to put any like, you know, like plastic bags or anything because this is see-through and whatnot. It's just perfect. Perfect for travel. Of course, it's also really interesting because whenever you do pull it out of your bag and it just says Supreme on it, you just feel really badass. <laughs> Anyways, um, inside this utility bag actually is another thing I wanted to mention as a December favorite, but it shouldn't come as a surprise for any of you guys, which is the Joan. Day and night cream keeps my skin moist, and of course, you guys know from both of the reviews that I posted, I really love the product. Another thing I did want to quickly shout out is this Bubble Bubble Foam Cleanser from The Face Shop. It's a really nice cleanser, and it's really hard to find, surprisingly, but if you can get your hands on one of these, it's a great feeling cleanser. Um, yeah, so that's about it for travel stuff. Here, I wanted to mention the Fear of God Essentials Paxun photo hoodie that I picked up earlier this month as well. And this hoodie is just so warm, so comfortable. I could not recommend it more for like colder weathers. Like, oh my gosh, the interior lining on this hoodie is just so soft and so welcoming for travel, for any sort of occasion. Definitely a December favorite, in my opinion at least. Um, so for the last, I guess, two or three December favorites, I don't really want to, like, pick up items per se, but just kind of discuss them. First on the discussion list, I wanted to mention the Spider-Man Spider-Verse movie. I thought this was such an inspirational movie, and of course, you guys already know, I was so inspired by the movie that I'm actually going to pick up the shoes so that I could review for you guys. Since I am away from home right now, I don't want to get anything shipped to my home, so I'll be picking them up after I get back. Anyways, that's a definite December favorites just because of the impact that it had and, you know, just how inspiring the movie was in general. I'm not going to spoil anything, so check it out for yourself if you have the time. And for the next December favorite, I wanted to mention some music favorites because it's kind of hand in hand with the movie actually. The soundtrack on that movie is amazing, hands down. If you were wondering what my favorite songs from the soundtrack are, I like What's Up Danger and, uh, goodness gracious, what's it called? Home. And those two songs are just really, really good. <laughs> Anyways, more on the music favorites actually, I wanted to mention some I guess more obscure music choices that I have fallen in love with this month. I really like Alan Walker's new album. I also really, really like Blizzard, which is the kind of highlight song for Dragon Ball Super's movie with Broly in it. And oh my god, you gotta work out to that song. Like, if you don't work out to Blizzard at least once in your life, you're doing it wrong. Like, it's just such a good gym song. I also really, really like Loco's Star, which I kind of featured in an earlier video. I used it for the video, actually, but um, it's from this K-drama that I watch. I'll link it down below, but such a clean song. It's really, really beautiful as well. I really like uh, Those Nights by Key from Shiny. It's part of his, like, I think it's also featuring Crush, too, but it's part of his comeback single solo album, so... Really good thing to check out. It's all like edm -y and stuff, so it's pretty cool. Of course, you know, those are just general music favorites. I really can't think of more off the top of my head, but yeah, enjoy them if you really are interested in the music choices that I have. Of course, special shout out to German rap because German rap in general is just super cool. Thank you so much to the subscriber that mentioned, you know, try reacting to German rap because it was super fun, my roommates really enjoyed it, and of course, the music is also super cool because, you know, the difference in the way that things are pronounced in German versus like English, 
yields to like a different dynamic of rap. I mean, I'll leave it at that. The reactions kind of show a lot of that, but you have to listen to it yourself if you if you need, if you want to understand what I mean by that. Of course, finally on my December favorites list, uh, I wanted to mention myself and you know the general idea of appreciating who you are and kind of what you do. You know, like in December, I think it's a great time to sit back and look at what you've done throughout the year, especially since, you know, it's about to be the New Year's and you're setting new goals for yourself and everything. But for me, I'm really proud of myself for a lot of the goals that I hit when I actually, you know, put my heart to it and grinded out the work. You know, I passed a super hard class at school. I definitely killed, you know, whatever fitness goals that I really tried to hit during like the year, I guess. On top of juggling YouTube, it was definitely a journey, you know? And these are things that I really feel proud of myself for, and I hope that maybe you guys can find pride in some of the things you do, you know? Like, if you want to go get the straight A's at school, go for it, you know? And if you want to, like, get the best hypebeast outfits out there, go for it, dude. Like, I'm, I'm here to tell you guys that my last December favorite is not just myself, I guess. But it's also like your guys' ambitions and your guys' hopes. You know, I hope you guys can really take what I'm saying from some of my content, some of my videos and stuff, and go on and do something super cool with it. You know, like maybe it's sizing, you know, maybe it's buying a piece that you style and you tag me in or whatever. I'll love it, I'll like it, you know, all of these things are super, super close to heart to me. So I hope you guys really enjoyed the content today. This about wraps up my December favorites video and yeah like and subscribe if you haven't already and if you dislike the video like anyways because you know it's just another number on the video you're really not going to tell me that you personally dislike the video at all I mean unless if you did it in the comment section but I mean who's got enough time to type all that <laughs> if you dislike the video you definitely won't be spending the time typing out that you dislike the video in the comment section Anyways, this is Kevin here. Have a safe and happy new year, you guys, and set the best new year's resolutions for yourselves to improve, to change for the better, and you know, all this positive stuff, because it's that time to be positive, to share happiness, and you know, just do things, bring change. It's good stuff. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. I'll see what I can upload. If my computer breaks again, it breaks, which will be unfortunate, but I'll see what I can upload in the meantime. Thank you guys for tuning in today, and happy holidays. <laughs>